This is Mount Everest. It's 8,848 meters in elevation or 29,035 feet, making it the highest mountain on earth. It's the highest peak of the Himalayan mountain range that lies right here in China, Nepal, India, Bhutan, Pakistan and Afghanistan. In the world there are 14 peaks that exceed the magical 8,000 meters of elevation and this mountain range holds 10 of them. The other four are in the Karo Karam mountain range that's just to the west of the Himalayas. In fact, the highest 32 peaks in the world are all in one of these two mountain ranges. But why is this part of the earth so elevated? Let's find out. Mountains are formed by tectonic and volcanic processes. When tectonic plates move towards each other, they push each other up and create a mountain. We call this process plate convergence. To give you an example, let's take a look at the Andes mountain range in South America. The Nazca plate collides with the South American plate and because the oceanic plate is heavier, it subducts underneath the continental plate of South America. The same happens in the Himalayas, where the Indian plate moves into the Eurasian plate, creating these huge mountains. But why are these ones so much bigger? Well, this mountain range is formed by the Indian and Eurasian plates, which have moved around for millions of years, just like the other plates. And this is a map of where the Indian plate was 71 million years ago. Since then, it has moved north, colliding with the Eurasian plate, and that created the highest mountains on earth. And the incredible elevation has everything to do with the speed that the plates are moving with. The Indian plate is the fastest moving plate on earth with a whopping 5 centimeters per year. And this may seem like it's not that much, but the average speed of all plates is just 1.5 centimeters per year. Meaning that the Indian plate is moving more than 3 times as fast. And what's cool is that these plates are still moving in the same direction, meaning that Mount Everest and all the other peaks are still getting taller as we speak. Scientists have said that they expect it to grow for millions of years to come. So, have you ever wondered which country has the highest average elevation? Click here to find out.